Okay, Linda, I'm sitting on the couch in our new motor home. This thing is beautiful. It is absolutely gorgeous. And rather than try to take pictures, I'm just going to do you a video. Everything in here is brand new. This thing is immaculate. And it is a nice floor plan. It's It, it literally is a blessing. This is just what we needed. Here's the TV little cubby up here. So we'll get a nice little TV to fit there, flat screen, and then there'll be room behind for stuff. Here is the upper bunk, which is fabulous. It will sleep two people comfortably, I might add. There's plenty of room here for two. And it's a nice tall ceiling here from top to bottom. Um, this thing has beautiful blinds, um, window coverings. There's your curtain, see, for your for your upper, whoops, for your upper bunk, there's your curtain. There's a curtain right here that's kind of hanging down, see it? That's for the, it covers the front here, it closes off the front. Here's the cabin, leather seats. This thing has 18,000 miles, 18,000. It literally is brand new. Here's your pretty sofa with your pretty accent pillows. This flips out to make a bed, a knife bed. This one flips out to make, you know, a, a sleeps too. So normally all you would need is that one, throw the kids on this one. You wouldn't even need this one, but technically you could sleep eight people in here if you wanted to. Um, nice cabinets up above. And entryway. Very nice. This is the command center. This is where you start your generator, check your water, turn on your water heater. There's keys, all of that. Kitchen sink. A cute little doggy right there. Here is the, you've got double cutting boards, which is nice. Stove oven, storage below, big storage under the sink, microwave, big cabinets up above, um, air conditioner right here, and it's ducted too, see those are the ducts, so you can duct it and direct air where you want it. Um, it's got good lighting, here's the refrigerator, it's a nice wood panel fridge, Nice shape, just about like the one we have in the in the fifth wheel. Freezer. So then we go to here's looking into the bedroom. Nice big windows on the sides. Little window in the back that does not open. It's just there for more light if you want light or to look out, but Generally, you just have your nice two big side windows here. Nice window coverings. Nice big cabinets in the back. Here's your... You have one of these on both sides, a wardrobe, see, like was in the camper. So one on there, one over there, plus these have shelves, see, and they're deep. These are nice deep cabinets, so you've got a lot of room there. The bed's very nice, the dresser's very nice, and honey, this thing is so clean. I mean, it looks like, compared to what we looked at at the dealer. I gotta run to town, we just leave that key here. I will do that, Nick. Where do you want me to leave it? Just on the front seat of the camper there. Uh, on the front seat, okay, will do, buddy. Thanks for helping me out. Yeah. I called JR, so. Oh, great. Yeah, we're gonna come back, so. Okay. Sounds I appreciate good. your help. I gotta take a picture of your dog for my wife, she'll oh. love it. Yeah, I'm leaving it What's right her here. name? Her name is Barbie, but we call her Sissy. Hi, Chichi. Hi, Chichi. I want one of these dogs, honey. She is so cute. All right, buddy. Well, thanks for your help, and I'll just leave the keys. Okay, that was Nick. So here's your bath. You have your vent. Here's your big mirror that is your medicine cabinet. Another big mirror here. This one doesn't open. Very nice sink. Nice faucets. Storage. 
toilet. Storage below. Okay, so, and look, another mirror there. So you got mirrors everywhere in here. Okay, here's your shower. It has the the little thing on top, the, um, what do you call it, skylight. Nice shower head. Has a clothes rack in there that comes out. It's right there. And that's just a bucket of water faucet. This is nice, honey. This is very nice. And for the price, I couldn't be more thrilled. That's a TV stand that comes down if you have a TV. Okay, I think that's about all. So inside, looking this way, see? This is a great layout. This is an excellent layout for what we need for right now. It's kind of like our camper, uh, only bigger and it's comfortable there's no slide outs that's fine we don't need them it's the ford v10 uh, motor which is good it has a 4000 watt generator it has nice steps here that retract back up in and it has storage absolutely everywhere oh entertainment center See that? You've got speakers, stereo, extra plug-ins, all kinds of cool stuff there. Hi, Chichi. Hi, Chish. Uh, the tires are like brand new. They're Toyos, which are good tires. Nice, pretty chrome rims. All of these are huge storage bays, all the way down both sides. They just flip up their pneumatic. And see, you've got storage everywhere on both sides. Hi, Sissy. Hi, Sissy. More storage. Awning. Like we just fixed. See it? Nice big awning. Runs all the way down this side. Ladder on the back. See, there's the back window. It doesn't open, but it'll let some light in. It's a Jayco designer. Down this side, more storage. Generators right in there. The um, thing to, or no, that's the thing to like drain the tanks and do all that. There's the gas. Up there's the generator. Right up here. Generator, and then of course your refrigerator, water heater, the furnace. All that's here. These are just more big storage bays. Do you see that in there, sis? See all that storage? It's even got a light. It's shut off right now. But it's even got lights in there. Okay, um, it's just a Ford E450 Super Duty with the Triton V10. Beautiful tires on the front, toils. Designer by Jayco. There's a little bit of D-Lamb stuff on this side, but no leaks. It's just a little sidewall. I'm not worried about it. The roof, I didn't see any leaks anywhere. Inside here, I got in and sat in it. It's comfortable. Um, leather interior, both sides, wood panel. Very nice. I started it up and ran it. I didn't drive it, but I, I started it and tested it. Windshield's perfect, no cracks. It this is a nice, nice coach, honey. This is this is the one. I just prayed about it, you know, it happened to work out. I got out of my test a little early and I came I thought I'll call that guy and he said, Well I'm not there, but the the yard guy's there and you can you can uh talk to him he'll show it to you so I did so there's the keys I told him we'd be back and we will I hope all right signing off bye